Now, if you go to a company in New Jersey, yeah, like um, IFF or somewhere, yeah, they have lovely sterile cubicle rooms to sit in yeah, for smelling. Yeah, for mica walls, for mica table, yeah, filtered air. Yeah. That's because they've tried to filter out all of the negative aspects when you smell. So when you're preparing your place to smell, what should you be looking for? No other smells. Anything else? No I dust? Avoid dust yeah, avoid dust. Good. It, UV light. Why UV light? Well, the UV light deodorizes light. Yeah? Yeah. Because when you, when you, after you do your laundry, yeah, you put it out in the sunshine. You put it out in the sunshine because the UV light deodorizes it, kills any bacteria that cause damp, damp smelling smells. Yeah? And it's the same in the room. Theophastus wrote about this 2,000 uh, two, two years ago, yeah? that when you smell, you should smell in a high place. And the reason for smelling in a high place is you get more UV light. Yeah? What other things are you looking for in your place to smell? No smell. What else is there? Place. Yeah, no visual distractions. I said about these white rooms. Yeah, should be comfortable. Yeah, but I think these white rooms actually don't work very well because they're too stark. You need something that's a little bit softer, a little bit more human. Yeah. Anything else? What else would affect smell? Temperature. Yeah, temperature and sound. Yes. We're coming to that. Yeah. Well, not entirely, but yeah, and that, that's yeah, that's yeah, that's roughly along the, the right lines. Yeah. If you're aiming at that, that's good. Yeah, humidity definitely plays a role. Yeah. So, you need somewhere in the middle. Or with temperature, you need somewhere in the middle. You don't want it too cold, because then you don't get the evaporation. You don't want it too hot, otherwise it becomes. 20, 25, yeah. Uh, humidity, 30 to 60, something like that, yeah. Like, not like 100 in Thailand, you know, <laughs> in the evening. But, do, but you notice, like, with the, the nighttime flowers, when the humidity gets very, very high in Thailand, that, that sm the smell of the flowers becomes very heavy too, yeah, very intoxicating. So humidity affects it too. You're looking for somewhere that's perfect. Where's the poss worst possible place to smell? Yeah. And where do most perfumers smell? The lab. Yeah. <laughs> so something to bear in mind. Yeah. Um, I know. You know. If we're smelling in the lab, very often go outside onto the nice, pollution-free eight-lane traffic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, to have a stiff. Sometimes it's better than inside the lab, yeah? You need to change the air. Yeah. So prepare your place. 